Good morning, Facebook friends. It certainly is good to be able to come back into your presence and to share with you coffee and conversation. What a great way to get another morning started, a fresh cup of hot coffee. Today, my friend, I want to talk to you about loneliness. Uh, I think there's probably been a time in all of our lives when uh, when we've all faced loneliness. In Psalm 94, 17, uh, we read these words. Unless the Lord had been my help, my soul had almost dwelt in a silence. My friend, loneliness can and does eat away at us like a cancer. Loneliness can really reach into us and destroy us if we'll let it. Loneliness can turn us inside out and twist our heart, twist our mind and soul into an unrecognizable mass of pain. You see, my friend, we all at one time or another experience loneliness. We have all experienced loneliness in the past, and we will experience loneliness in the future. What are we to do about loneliness? Man, that's a good question. In terms of our spiritual life, we must understand that we need never to be spiritually lonely. For when we open our heart up to the Lord Jesus Christ, he is with us and he will stay with us forever. Beloved, when we are lonely, uh, we must realize Christ is standing next to us every minute. The Bible says that he'll never leave us, nor will he ever forsake us. Uh, When we are lonely, we must realize Christ is pouring his love over us us every minute of every day. When we're lonely, we must realize Christ wants us to talk to him and he wants us to listen to him as he speaks back into our spirit. When we're in Christ, the pain of our loneliness can be washed away. When we are in Christ, we have reached the pinnacle of of being connected to the power of love, the strongest power of love in the entire universe. No wonder the psalmist penned, unless the Lord had been my help, my soul had almost dwelt in silence. Oh, my friend, I realize and know that we all want that human touch and we all want that human being to speak to. But whenever it would seem no one is around and that no one cares, look to Jesus. Speak to him and listen to him as he speaks to your heart and he'll help you through your times of loneliness. Hey, God bless you today. You be careful out in the world. Make a difference in your world. Remember to smile. Let others see Jesus in you. For your life may be the only Bible that some will ever read. Father, today I pray for that one who may be hearing the devotion that is the loneliest. May they see you in a new way, and may you be their strength and help. In Jesus' name, amen.